Hey everybody, hope you're having a good Christmas so far. Uh, I'm just going to do a real quick uh, video for uh, for everybody, but also as a response for my friend Andre, and uh, just give you a quick glimpse of my uh, my collection of vintage Star Wars figures that I have here in my swanky office. Uh, try to slowly pan through this so you can see what I have. Um, almost all of them have accessories, and I, I, I like I mentioned before, uh, some of the accessories are repros, but uh, let me see if I can just kind of cut through there. And I'm going to focus on um, the Boba Fett. I also have some uh, figures elsewhere in my office, like a Gamorrean Guard and um, FX3, the Surgical Droid, and uh, some others. But um, this is kind of like the core of my collection right here. Okay. Um, let's pull out Boba Fett here and take a look at him. This is the 1980 Boba Fett and uh, very closely resembles the new mail away that Andre was showing on his review. Uh, of course, it has the non firing rocket, as you can see right there. It was just a peg that was put in there. And we all know the story. They recalled it because a child had choked on a Battlestar Galactic Galactica toy. And uh, let me give you a, a look at the uh, original blaster. And it seems that uh, Hasbro has uh, duplicated that pretty well, too. Um, concerning these figures, um, loose wise, the most valuable one arguably is the uh, indoor Luke with the battle poncho on. Uh, pretty much the most difficult one to get loose. It's one of the last 17 figures. Uh, another one that's pretty hard to get would be the uh, Han Solo and Carbonite figure that came out as well. The last 17s are pretty much the hardest ones to get, and this is one of them. Um, and um, so I'm pretty glad to have that one. And uh, anyway, this was just a quickie video here. And uh, of course, it, it, as we move on, I'd like to show you all of these figures in greater detail. So, uh, and when I said that's the most valuable. I meant the most valuable in my set. Uh, obviously, it's not the vinyl Cape Jawa or anything, so I don't want to mislead anybody. Anyway, that was a quick one, and I'll be back with some more. Bye.